The King Has Come is a Christmas song that we wrote that's not just a Christmas song. <laughs> that's probably the best way to describe that's it. True. We set out to write a Christmas song with a friend of ours, and as we got to the end of writing it, we realized, I don't think this is just a Christmas song. I yeah. think this is I a song. I think even during writing it, we were kind that's of true. aware of, okay, I think this <laughs> is not true. just going to be... I think this is a, a worship song that can really be sung anytime. Yes. Um, but, you know, I mean, it has the word manger in it, so yes. that's got to count for From something. the jump of the song. There you yeah. go. So there you go. Christmas song. <laughs> uh, but you guys will see what we mean when you hear it, but it, it can kind of go either way. Yeah. Um, but what I love about this song is that it really takes me to this place of being overwhelmed with the presence and glory of God yeah. when I sing it and worship to it. Mm -hmm. There's just something about realizing what it means now that the king has come. And the bridge talks about that whole idea of, do you know what this means? The captive is now set free. And when you really think about the implications of Jesus Christ coming to this earth, it's overwhelming. Yeah, sure. And your response is, glory to God, glory to God in the highest. Like You just want to worship. Yes. And that's what I love about this song is it takes you to that place of worship yes and and it puts words to that feeling that you get when you think about the fact that the king has come yes and, and i think to trying to i mean we did our best to try and capture the the weight of that moment yeah. and also the triumphant aspect of that moment of okay the angels are, have appeared to the shepherds in the field announcing that the Christ has come and the shepherds are terrified, but they're getting this news, which is the best news they could have ever received. They've been waiting for centuries for this news. The Messiah, the anointed one has come. And then the heavenly hosts, the angelic hosts join and they sing glory to God in the highest. What is that moment like? This chorus is us trying to capture that. Yeah. And then as we get to the bridge, you know, we have the, the part that says the King has come here, are these aspects, the implications of it, the meaning to it. Mm -hmm. And then we have another bridge after that, which we didn't plan on doing two yeah. bridges, but maybe you can share how we landed on that. Yeah. So initially we had a bridge that's different than the one we have now. It was the same concept yeah. talking about, do you know what this means? But the melody was different, but something about it just wasn't sitting completely right with us. Yeah. So we decided, why don't we just worship? I got on the microphone in our studio and We'll just see what comes out. We'll just see what comes yeah. as our natural response in this moment. And um, I started singing the hallelujah part, or the what's now the second bridge. Hallelujah to the Savior, hallelujah to the Son, that whole part. And after I sang it, we both just felt like this is... Yeah, this, this is, needs to be in the song. This needs to be in the song. This yeah. feels really right. But we knew that that wasn't, that wasn't it. We knew it needed another part before. Yeah. Uh, so and then Wes kind of fleshed that out and, yes. and worked on that that first yeah. that first bridge. Yeah. So Christmas has become about so many other things than just Jesus, but our hope with this song is that it would bring it back and center it on Him, giving Him the glory, giving Him our our lives in worship, and ultimately singing, Hallelujah, God be praised. Yeah. We're so grateful that you came, and because of your coming everything really has changed. So we pray this Christmas the song blesses you and more than anything else causes you to worship Jesus with everything uh, as we approach the holidays and beyond that since it's not just a Christmas song. So thank you guys for listening and we pray it blesses you.